big boy. This is where all the hard work, sacrifice, and painful scaldings pay off. Four pounds of grease. That comes to... 63 cents. Woohoo! Dad, all that bacon cost $27. Yeah, but your mom paid for that. But doesn't she get her money from you? And I get my money from Greece. What's the problem? Wow. Look at that load of Greece. Boy, if we're ever gonna earn paper money, we have to expand our operation. Um, I don't know how much more school I can miss. Oh, you'll miss plenty. I have a feeling this business is going to consume our whole lives. Alex, over here! Okay, if the new girl sits with us? Oh, okay. okay, I guess. She's a little weird, but let's give her a chance. Guys, this is Alex. Hi there. Hi. Ooh, twins. Which one is the evil one? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll go get our lunches. So, Alex, uh, will you just a sec? Hello? Huh? <laughs> oh, yeah, like I'd be seen with a Discover card. You have a cell phone? That's it. Don't be shy. Now maybe a little joke to break the ice. <laughs> or a big joke. Careful now. Nobody likes to show off. Where are they going? Hey, wait up! They left without me. Oh, Lisa! I've got an extra seat. And you've got an extra lunch. <laughs> Catch my drift. <laughs> Millhouse, lower those eyebrows. And the other one. So there I am, being nice to Alex, and she takes all my friends and ditches me. I'm sure they didn't ditch you, honey. Maybe they won't have to plan a surprise party for you. <laughs> oh, yeah. Good one, Mom. They only like her because she acts too grown up with her perfume and her cell phone and... Oh, and get this, Mom. She drinks iced tea. Lisa, I can't imagine anyone being more likable than you. But apparently this new girl is. So my advice would be to start copying her in every way. But, Dad... Uh-uh, think. Is that what Alex would say? Listen, I'm sorry I ran out on you yesterday, but the girls couldn't wait to show me that tree. Huh, don't give it a second thought. Huh, I didn't. Anyway, I got you a little present. Oh, earrings. Wow, thank you so much, Alex. Oh, but these are for pierced ears. Yeah, aren't they great? Alex did ours. Yeah, all you need is a thumbtack and a whole lot of paper towels. Uh, but I don't think I'm ready for pierced ears. Well... Maybe you can put them on your doll. <laughs> Just kidding, Lise. I'm sure you'll be ready someday. Oh, Lisa, I was hoping I could count on you again to spearhead our annual school-wide apple pick. Absolutely. Apple pick? Yeah, it's great. We have pony rides, sing-alongs, apple bobbing, apple picking, apple everything. Oh, you forgot apple bobbing. No, I didn't. Didn't your old school have apple picks? No, we weren't big on fruit. We were more into, like, Dances. You know, things that are fun. A dance? Great idea, Alex. Yeah. Principal Skinner, can we have a dance instead? Oh, oh yeah. yeah. It's it's great. Great. We can do it. Well, uh, we've never had a dance before. Lisa, you'd be doing all the work. What do you think? Mm, I don't know. The ponies might be startled by the loud music. Well, there wouldn't be ponies. Oh, then, at the risk of being unpopular, I think I'm going to have to say... School dance? I didn't approve any school dance. Yes, you did yesterday, right by my locker. 